Now let's go right to Michigan Tech. A busy night starts out with hockey. NMU and Michigan Tech first period off the turnover. Hello, Marquette's Justin Ford. He gets his 12th of the year, even strength goal, and it's 1-0 Wildcats. 42 seconds later, Tyler Gron get the puck over to Kyle Fulmer, and he slides that through. Josh Robinson, ain't 2 nothing NMU lead. We jump to the second period, and here comes Michigan Tech. David Johnstone will tiptoe that one across from Blake Petal and Steven Seigel, his fifth of the year. Less than two minutes later, still on a five-on-three power play, or five-on-four, David Johnstone would strike again. From Petal and Ryan Fern, we are tied at two. About three minutes and 20 seconds later, Wildcats on the power play. Zing, there's Flork right in the middle of everything for number 13. Another good pass from Tyler Grun, who ended up with three helpers on the night, including this one coming up to Matt Thurber. You saw it beforehand. Wildcats add an empty netter and go on to win 5-2. They had a great crowd. The rivalry's as strong as it, you know, it's ever been. Uh, Tech's a very good hockey team. It's, it's coming and growing quickly. And, uh, so those are big wins. Those are, those are big wins. And to take those guys out of it early was, was critical. Capitalizing on the, the opportunities have been huge for us this year, and especially in this game. They had a couple small breakdowns, whether it's in their zone or a penalty like that. So just trying to capitalize on that and put them back in the net is our goal. Northern got off to a good start. You know, they put us behind the eight ball right off the get-go there. Um, you know, and we battled back. Uh, I was proud of our kids for that. And then we had that five on three. It was a turning point in the game, I thought. Both teams will be on the road next weekend.